There are inventions that prove to be instrumental to our way of life. Electricity, the automobile, flight, the internet. There is one technology I haven't mentioned that we interface with daily and probably don't even think twice about. It affects all the others mentioned and more. Let me reintroduce you to the Global Positioning System. And this year, we have a lot to celebrate. 50 years since the inception of GPS and 30 years fully mission capable. You know, thinking about the civilian user, they use GPS for some of the most simple things, whether that's ordering food or, you know, navigation is a big one. You know, getting to the most, getting to point A to point B in the most efficient manner possible. GPS was initially designed for military applications, but it became clear that the system could have transformative effects through civilian use. In 2000, President Bill Clinton signed a bill allowing full functionality of GPS for the civilian market. The second space operations squadron in the master control station on Schriever Space Force Base monitors and protects more than 30 GPS satellites day and night. I think one thing I tell my friends is that there's nothing to worry about. You don't ever question whether or not you have GPS. Those happen on the operations floor and our operators are uh, working day to day to ensure that GPS is accurate. That way all the users, whether or not they're civil or military, can rely on GPS and don't have to worry about whether or not uh, they have enough satellites overhead or whether or not they're providing the precise timing or the precise location for that. Um, the operators do all that work behind the scenes. GPS requires precise orbits and timing. And these guardians and reserve airmen give commands daily to the system to ensure it remains accurate for a worldwide user base. We have over 6 billion users estimated that we touch across the entire world. Now, obviously that's a phenomenal number, but when you look at what that 6 billion actually is, we have the everyday users, the people that are on their phones, whether it's in the United States, it's Europe, it's anywhere in the world. Um, but also everybody's economies are tied in at this point to GPS and our timing capability. We want to make sure that we are very transparent in everything that we do and we do not deny anyone GPS services and we provide service, uh, GPS service across the globe. Precision farming using GPS coordinates allows farmers to plant and harvest the most efficient rows of crops on their land. Rain, dust and low visibility are no longer obstacles as GPS guides farming equipment across the land. GPS also ensures that the purchases we make online are delivered on time. From keeping congested naval shipping lanes moving to helping 10,000 tractor trailers move cargo in and out while reducing traffic jams, GPS keeps products and services moving. We have a team of individuals that are 24-7 manned on our operations floor and they're their actual role and what our mission is, is let's call them external outreach. They're going to be the ones that if, let's say the FAA has an issue or there's GPS jamming at any airport across the United States, they might be the ones that are getting these phone calls to figure out what is wrong with GPS. Is there anything wrong with GPS? Is it wrong with my receiver? Something going on with your satellites? So we actually have a team of individuals that their full job is just dedicated to I jokingly call them the customer support of GPS. Worldwide aviation relies on GPS timing to coordinate air travel, while air traffic controllers use GPS to navigate crowded air routes. It can also guide over ocean routes where traditional ground-based communications would not be able to operate. Financial transactions also depend on the security and reliability of GPS. Each GPS satellite carries an atomic clock that keeps real time down to nanoseconds. This ability to track actual time outside of earthbound time zones allows financial transactions from Wall Street to Tokyo to have reliable timestamps. Even our power grids are enhanced by GPS. In North America, AC electricity modulates at a 60 Hz frequency, regulated by time as power is transferred between plants, stations, and homes. The more accurate the timing, the more efficient the service. And with many of our portable devices connecting to GPS, we can feel confident knowing the times we see on our phones and watches are exact and in sync. GPS is woven into the fabric of our modern lives. From transportation to agriculture, finance to utilities, and more, GPS is indispensable. We understand that we have um, a big responsibility on our shoulders. Um, you've got everyone from you know the age of just out of high school, um, new guardians to civilians who have been around since 
the beginning of, of GPS as a concept. So um, no matter where you are in between those, you understand that you know, this is a big responsibility and it requires a team effort to, to get the job done. So we lean heavily on each other. Uh, everyone knows exactly what their role is and what their responsibility is um, and takes it incredibly serious. And we make sure to take care of one another along the way. The next time you look up those directions, use an ATM or pick up that on-time package from your porch. Remember, the United States Space Force is keeping it safe and reliable. Happy anniversary, GPS. Secured and protected by the United States Space Force.